Dr. Deepak Chopra and as you can see right now I am in direct contact with the earth if you can see my feet I'm in direct contact with the earth I'm also in direct contact with this tree and through this tree with the earth above me 50 miles and beyond is the ionosphere full of positive electrical charge the earth the surface of the earth right now is neutral electrical charge but essentially the negative pole for the earth the positive pole probably being deep within the center of the earth where there's a lot of iron and other minerals so at this moment my body which is a battery literally a battery because it's a biofield electrical biofield my body and because it's in contact with the surface of the earth and both directly and through the tree and because I'm connected to the ionosphere at this moment my bioelectrical field which is my body is in alignment with the earth's electromagnetic field and negative ions are coming from the earth into my body and neutralizing the excess positive ions that have built up in my body as a result of being in env environments where there's too much positive electrical discharge as in urban environments indoor environments and of course uh, uh, if I'm not connected to the earth then as a result of anything lack of sleep uh, too much uh, stress uh, a disruption in circadian rhythm like jet lag uh, what happens is excess free radicals and positive ions build up in the body but right now they're being neutralized so I can reset my biological rhythms and um, also become bioelectrically neutral in the sense that I and the earth and the ionosphere are one so this is what grounding is and these days because a lot of us wear rubber shoes and because we are indoors all the time um, our bodies are basically bioelectrically imbalanced and that results in inflammation which is the basis of many chronic illnesses so um, one way uh, to uh, decrease inflammation and discharge the excess free radicals and ions is to be naturally grounded as I am and the other is using grounding devices whether it's a mat or a yoga mat or, or a grounding chair anything that connects you to the earth no it doesn't matter where you are 30 floors above um, the ground on the Empire State Building or World Trade Center or anyway you can still have this connection to the earth that's the value of grounding now once you get in touch with the earth and start to become bioelectrically aligned with the earth's field then it is my theory that you not only balance the circadian rhythms that get disrupted when you have jet lag but because as the earth is spinning on its axis and moving and circulating around the sun it's both rotating and revolving around the sun and because of the complicated movement of the earth sun and moon with each other and the gravitational effect of the sun and the stars and the moon and the entire universe our circadian rhythms are also linked to um, what I call seasonal rhythms and lunar rhythms and gravitational rhythms and all these rhythms are in synchronicity with each other so if I ground myself and reset my circadian rhythms which is what my biology responds to the circadian code is embedded in my DNA but by resetting my circadian clock 
and because I'm in contact with all there is, and because the circadian rhythm is part of the seasonal rhythms, the lunar rhythms, the gravitational rhythms, I'm actually resetting my entire biological clock so that it is in harmony with uh, universal rhythms, cosmic rhythms. This is the basis of healing in Ayurveda to restore harmony between the microcosm and the macrocosm.